Hey guys, Infidel1258 here. I want to do a video today talking about Steam and Steamit.com. I've talked about Steamit before. If you're, if you're new to my channel or uh, you've never heard of it, you can check out previous videos where I get into detail about how you can use it to reward crypto, to how you can use it to earn daily rewards in the form of cryptocurrency. It's paid out in Steam and Steam back dollars. Like I said, I've got kind of detailed videos that break that down. Check them out. But today, just a, a quick video talking about Steam token, uh, its current valuation and um, support levels and what's what's happening um, lately with it. So last couple of days, it's been flirting with the support resistance line of around 59 cents. It was riding below there, about 56, 58 cents. And uh, now it's above 61, I think. But um, it's absolutely... Um, been kind of flirting with falling significantly lower and of course it's concerning from a uh, um, as an investor I, I you know I own a fair bit of steam and I'd love to see the price r roar back to its previous highs but um, that's just not where we're at right now and you know if you're following the Bitcoin um, cash hard fork and the war around that and the implications of uh, you know that it's having on BTC because of mining um, restructuring. Um, different mining companies are taking their mining power from BTC over to BCH to try and decide who wins that battle. It's having ramifications for the entire market and and in the short term that's probably going to persist. Um, crypto markets are around 180 billion right now and I think it's going to be seems like it's kind of not ready to go much higher. Hopefully we can get back to 200 billion and see Bitcoin again around 6,100, 6,200. But if Bitcoin doesn't go, then the rest won't go. And uh, and so, yeah, Steam's sitting on some support right now, but um, it's been flirting with lower. And I said in a previous video that, you know, there's not really much support until all the way down at 29 cents US per Steam, which is mostly true. But looking at the older charts you can see that steam actually has support at you know 50 in the 50 cent range but you're talking about going all the way back to like the summer of 2016 and it's only a couple data points that kind of that draw that support so i don't feel that's very strong so i'm a little bit i feel like this price of steam right now is a little precarious and i wouldn't be i'm not buying any i'm not adding to my position on on steam but i am earning steam every day through my videos like this and um, my comments and my photos um, check me out at infidel1258 on steamit.com sign up for free and you know check it out it's a lot of fun that's the thing about steam see the chart might be a little scary the support might be bare the price points might fall but frankly I'm using my coin I'm using my cryptocurrency daily in a fun way that entertains me and that rewards me with uh, more of the same token. And because of the utility of the platform and, and all the many apps that are already functioning on it, I find that Steam is so much farther ahead of most cryptocurrencies because it has real utility today, not planned utility tomorrow. You know, you've got steamit.com and you've got busy.org and you've got uh, Steepshot and uh, DLive and DTube and um, Partico and a, a half a dozen other um, decentralized plot or um, decentralized applications that run on top of the Steam blockchain, which have fun and utility and um, you know and and use right now. So you don't need to be thinking about speculation for where where. Um, coin ABC is going to go in five years or how many people are going to adopt it you can get into cryptocurrency today in the form of steam and play and have fun and earn now um, it's the future is really it's like it's here we just need to use it so yes the price could fall from its current valuation of 61 cents US dollars per steam um, I hope it doesn't but it certainly could but even if it did that wouldn't scare me and I wouldn't I wouldn't leave the space. I'd be continuing to do my thing and earning my cryptocurrency daily for a point in the future where I suspect the platform will be more and more adopted 
and the coin will be more and more um, valued. You've got increasing numbers of participants in the network. You've got uh, Metcalfe's law that speaks into the value of a network based on the number of users. You've got the utility of the token growing with applications that are on the network growing. You've got smart media tokens that are coming to the space that are going to increase liquidity and um, demand for the Steam Power or Steam token uh, because it's going to be a trading pair for these smart media tokens. So there's just a lot of reason to stay excited about Steam, and that's one of the reasons why I talk about it here. I get the feeling most people don't care because it's it's usually one of my least viewed videos, but it's something I'm interested in, and um, so I'm going to keep talking about it. And um, if you don't know about it, you should check it out. You can check, you can w look at my page without having a membership. Um, you go steamit.com forward slash at infidel1258 and um, and check it out. Just see what you know I post or who I comment on and see what they post. And you know, you can watch videos there like YouTube, you can read blogs, um, look at people's photos, or um, just follow their their whatever they're into. So it's a lot of fun and you should check it out. That's all for today, guys. Um, it's a beautiful sunny day and Maybe I'll just show you the sunshine and the trees. And uh, yeah, guys, so I hope you're having an awesome day. Oh, and for anybody who's interested, Lumina, my daughter, um, she's doing much better. She's still sick, but um, her seizures have slowed and her coughing has stopped. And, and she just seems like she's getting a lot better. So thank you very much for your concern and uh, for your prayers. I hope you have an awesome day. And God bless you guys. Bye.